Hello guys, Chris here and welcome back to another video. Today, my friends, I am back here trying to fix my HD7870, which is right now under a 2000 watt hair dryer because I can't really use the oven to do this. So I'm gonna try to do this this way. I'm gonna leave it like that for like 20 minutes, maybe 15. I don't know. I'm actually not sure how much time I need for it to be effective, you know. An oven is much more, uh, better at getting heat into that dye, but yeah, it's that it's pointing directly into the dye as you can see and I'll be back in 20 minutes or so to report back on you. All right guys, I'm back here and 23 minutes have passed, I think, maybe around that. So I'm just going to turn it off right now. All right, so we just took that out of there and I'm just going to leave it like there cooling down a little bit because it's very hot right now. So I'll be back in a few. All right, guys, we're back here with the GPU. Now it has been like 23 minutes, I think, and it's cooled down. So uh, I'm just going to clean it up a little bit from dust, you know. OK, that should be good. I'm gonna place the thermal paste now, the cheap one again, because we don't know if it worked, right? Oh, uh, just a little bit, because the last time I actually put a little bit too much of thermal paste here. Let me spread it out. Maybe a tiny bit more. All right, that's good. And now we just gotta close this. Just gotta put the cooler back in again and we're gonna test it all right here we go line it up a little bit here okay that's good and the last screw is in let's try to plug it in all right here we go we got the 7870 here i'm gonna put it inside the case into the motherboard here we go so the power circuits are still good as you can see it lights up so oh, it's not an eight pin it's two six pins one is down and the other one is good so i'm gonna plug in the dvi cable here because that was the only port that actually worked okay it's in now guys I don't think this will work, but I will actually be super impressed if it does. <laughs> I'm gonna push the power button and it's on guys. Let's see. Does it display an image? Yes! What? Oh my god! What? Holy crap it worked! <laughs> Holy shit! Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait. wait. The lines aren't here anymore. We're actually booting into Windows. <laughs> What? <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! Are you kidding me? I was actually not expecting this to happen, but okay, it looks like so far, at least, the the heater, the, not the heater, the hair dryer did something. We are putting into Windows. We didn't put into Windows before. Yes, it's oh showing an God. image, and it's at 1080p. It's not stretched out, you know. <laughs> Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> we are into Windows. Okay. Everything's working. Let me see here in AMD Radeon settings if it actually shows up. The graphics card that is. Let me actually go into MSI Afterburner first. So yeah, AMD Radeon HD 7800 series with the Crimson Relief 17.1.1 drivers. The GPU is working, guys! What the? <laughs> Holy crap, it worked! Well, guys, thank you for the tips. Because actually, some of you were uh, telling me to do this with the, the hair dryer. <laughs> and holy damn! I wasn't really expecting that. I'm, I'm really surprised here. Last thing to do, guys, is just run a game and see if it crashes or something. I'm actually gonna reposition this. Wait. Okay guys, so the AMD settings didn't open, so I'm not sure what's wrong with that, but uh, I'm gonna see if we can actually play a game here. Let, let's do CSGO then, yeah. I'm baffled though. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. It did work, so wow. So the game is opening. Let's wait. It didn't crash. Maybe it didn't crash, I don't know. Yeah. So we're, we're running it. 
Okay, so we're good here. 100 FPS in the menu. Uh, pro <laughs> what the hell? All right, I'm gonna put the um, multi sampling, the NTA leasing on maximum to push the graphics card a little bit more, you know? Uh, wow, are you kidding me? Yeah, I'm gonna actually record this sound now with Audacity here so you guys can hear something, you know? Okay, so we got sound now. Let's get back into CSGO. Come on. It's loading the map, so it's a little bit slow. Holy crap. <laughs> Come on, CSGO. Not, probably not the best game to test it with. Okay, okay. I'm getting a little bit scared now, guys, but the, the, the phone just stopped recording because it hit the 10 minute line, but uh, yeah, uh, we're here. We've been playing for like a minute or so and the, the, the graphics card is actually working fine here I'm gonna wait and get into another match to show you. All right guys. So we're back here As you can see guys The card is running fine here What the hell man? I was really not expecting this. I think it's a one gigabyte model. I'm not sure I actually haven't taken a look yet at that uh, are there one gigabyte models of the 7870 though? I'm, I'm not sure. But, well, so far so good. <laughs> uh, the hair dryer worked. What the hell? This is, wow. I, I have no words right now. You have to, do you want to say anything, Digimon? I'm amazed. <laughs> Just that. Oh my god. Okay, so... I think this is the best thing I've ever seen. How? How is this the best really? thing? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Alright, it's working fine! It's at 98% usage, 59 degrees Celsius. No signs of it crashing or anything like that. I was actually expecting it to, to like behave badly in some way, but... No! Everything's working fine here. Wow, I'm truly amazed guys. I'm gonna get out of CSGO now and I'm gonna run hardware info here. All right, let me check the clock speeds here. Uh, we were running at, let me check, GPU clock speeds, where is it? Core clock, there it is, 1000 megahertz on the core, so it wasn't throttling or anything. As you can see, it's set to 1000 and 1200, memory, uh, 1200 megahertz on the memory, so it wasn't throttling in the memory as well. Well, guys, I guess we fixed it. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's a 7870, as you can see here. Probably not, let me zoom in. Uh, okay, this is a little bit tricky. Okay. Uh, focus, good. So it's an HD 7870, as you can see. It's running fine, two gigabytes. Well, I don't know what to say, guys. I, I'm really, really surprised it worked. 7870 again, here we go. Two gigabytes. All right, it's working. If it does some artifacting, I will let you know, but so far so good. Um, if it does some artifacting, I might try to downclock it or something, but okay. Well, just an update, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, I truly did enjoy it, and I will see you in the next one. I love you all, bye-bye. Bye. Oh my god. <laughs>